My name is Mahesh Anand and I investigate moon rocks collected by the Apollo astronauts. These moon rocks are on loan from NASA for our research. And as you can see, we keep them safe and sound. These may look tiny, but these precious fragments reveal a fascinating geological history of the moon, extending all the way back to four and a half billion years ago when the moon was formed. Now we unlocked some of its secrets by slicing it into a very thin slice, uh, which you can see under this virtual microscope, which you can click onto at the end of this video. It is a very intuitive tool, so please experiment with it. The three boxes here shows the slice under three different lighting conditions. Clicking on XPL shows a set of diagnostic colors that allows us to understand what are the different minerals that are present in this rock, as well as the textures that rock is made up of. Clicking on a ref box allows us to see one of the most common minerals that occurs on the moon. It is called ilmenite. We can also see that we are looking at a volcanic rock because of these crazy random patterns in which these minerals are distributed in this rock, which means that this rock formed from the cooling of a molten lava. Crucially, this rock also contains minerals with water in them, but we need a far more powerful microscope to know exactly what they are. Finding the evidence of water in moon rocks is very exciting because we gain understanding of where the water in the solar system has come from. It also allows us to explore the possibility of extracting water from moon rocks. And one reason why we can explore these fundamental questions is in large part due to these wonderful tiny fragments. 